Are we back? Good? Picnic? You see me? Okay. Sounds good. So, what I think happened was, um, like, the dialogues or stuff, because it was so prolonged, um, I don't know. Maybe, maybe, like, Twitch admin came in and was like, oh, you're showing boobs on this game? Like, pfft, done. So, I don't know. Like, whatever. The game. Can't really fix it. So, uh, welcome back. Uh, to catch you up, Yennefer and I, or Yennefer and Geralt, had sex. And then some weird wolf chasing deer metaphor happened at the same time. We came back, to, told some story. Yin said that she wants to put Uma through the first part of making a witcher so that he's more easily moldable like clay or whatever and not crumbly. Uh, she left, now we're playing Gwent. I've won the first round. See, I got two things. He only has one. Here we are. I will play this card. Yep. He gets seven, but I get two cards. Damn it, not the ones I wanted. Hope he has a card like that. And then I can like target dummy it away. All right, back. That's really weird. I think it might have been the romance scene. I don't know. Maybe Twitch has some kind of boob det detecting technology where it's like, ah, banned. Which is silly, because I've seen other streamers like play like God of War and also uh, the Witcher games just fine. You know, it's part of the game. It's not really like accented or anything. Besides, I'm trying to craft a good story. And I want to be with Yennefer. And a lot of other people do. Hmm. So he has two cards, and he's Nilfgaard. So... I'll play this, kill off a seven. He'll play one card and I can stop. And be fine. Yeah, I'm not. He has to catch up. He has to make huge gains with a single card. Probably not gonna happen, it's probably weather. Or whatever. We'll never know. But I win! Yay! Good game, Geralt. Especially that move with the... Esco. He doesn't need any praise, just pour. Nice way to ride around this actually describing. Let's have some fun. Come on. Let's have some fun. Are we boring you? No, it's just kind of... Slow. Pretty boy's right. Listen, there's this game, student from Oxenford taught me. Hmm? Someone starts by saying, I've never, and finishing the sentence however they want. I Who's really like Wind. It's so fun. Some. Then it's the next guy's turn. Sounds great. You start. I've Thank never you for the compliment. Slept with a succubus. I forgot how, how to listen to this. Expected girl might have. I don't but think I've slept you? with the succubus yet. I wanted to. I tried. Eskel, but... Eskel. Still waters run deep. I'm a sucker for women with horns. Right, my turn. I've never, after a bender, woken up wearing nothing but my knickers. I think I'm playing the game right. Geralt? Lambert's a lost cause, but you? What would Papa Vesemir Okay, Vesemir so drinking say? is I have done those Dang, things. Papa Vesemir would have drank that round too. All right, Geralt, your turn. I've never... 
Um... Jumped out a lover's window. That's so. Nah. <laughs> Must have been one tough character whose wife you were plowing. That wasn't it. He was a friend. Didn't want to hurt his feelings. Yeah. You're a true friend. Right. Man. Let's end on that. Or else I'll never be able to look you in the eyes again. <sighs> Colder and up a nice giant's ass in here. Gentlemen, I shall return. We all know what you let that woman do with her horns. Oh, yeah. Fancy things. Do you and Lambert get along? In a way, I've learned not to talk to him about certain things. Guessing that's quite a list. <laughs> it is. Hello, youngins. Got your own little carnival going, eh? Alcohol, my good men, is a witcher's worst enemy. Where did you dig up that bonnet? Vesemir's trunk. The height of fashion in 1112. Old man probably put it on when he went courting. Or in the jargon of the time, wooing the damsels. Men, a witcher's life is not all cards and liquor. It is toil. It is labor. No gurgling babes to wean for us. Nay, not for us. All right. One Vesemir is enough. Take that off before you get it dirty. And pour. Oh, I'll pour, Eskel. I'll pour. To the brim. Because without vodka, you're as stiff as a bookkeeper in a body gap. Ah, uh, some of you laugh. So, watch this about a Samavilla? Snared this peasant in her dance. Instead of being happy, he escaped with his life. Yokel fell head over heels in love. Wanted me to trap her. Turned him down. So he tried it on his own with a fishing net. Bet you they're still dancing a mazurka in some fallow field. Great story. With a moral, too. Really? What's that? Stay away from dangerous women. Hmm. All right, change the subject. Because you refuse to admit I'm right? Whatever. Fine. Stop being a smart ass and poor. <sighs> Vodka. Vodka's gone. Who's going to go get some more? Already went. To get food. All right, I'll do it. Kitchen. It's that way, right? So, as someone who doesn't really get drunk, is this normal? Oh, Lambert. Bud, gotta tell you something. Yeah? Sometimes you're a real jackass, but I love you, brother. And sometimes you're a real blowhard. But damn it, I go to hell and back for you. Come here, yo. <laughs> damn. Broke. Good thing it was empty. Huh. Where's Esco? Should have been back by now. We ought to look around. This is a job for Vesemir. Not again. Take that hat off. Where's that whippersnapper wandered off to? He could be beleaguered, I wager. Come, men, to the rescue. People are weird. Why do they have to get drunk to say I love you to each other? <sighs> well, I don't know. Eskel, chop, chop. Find Eskel using witcher senses, really. Spilled some wine and crawled through it. Had to kneel down to see that. If I'd have bent over, I'd have puked. Oh, jeez. Eskel! Eskel! Maybe it's a witcher thing. You know, they can't feel emotions normally. Eskel, chop, chop. Why do I get the sense good things aren't going to happen? 
Like, I, I have a feeling. Esco, you drunk! Get out! I have here. a feeling bad things are happening. Hey, you hear that? Sounded like panting of a wounded wyvern. Damn it! We missed a fight. I think he. And he hurt himself. What's one scar? Uh huh. Esco's close. Hang in there, brother. We're coming. Leader. Esco, you drunk. Get up. Hey, look. There he is. With his ever faithful little bleeder. Clever, Fracta. Clever. Oh, Esco. Wake up! Uh, what? What happened? Got oh, sloshed, quickly. stewed, yeah. and 57 other varieties of drunk. That's what happened. Get up! Time to have a drink. Let me alone. I'm gonna puke. Three of us get together, always ends like this. Let's find a fourth. Better. A woman. Nothing here but Yen. Oh, we don't want to wake her up. Believe me. What about that sorceress you talked to? Think about it. We turn on the megascope, cordially invite her, she teleports here. Maybe bring some friends. How's that sound? That sounds awful. Lambert, believe you've had your last drink. You're just jealous you didn't think of it first, but is that any reason to spoil it for us? I don't have the strength to argue. Of course you don't, cream puff. Bet I could take you with one finger. Hey, relax, Lambert. Wanna fight? Huh? Wanna? Come on. Good night. <laughs> All right, well, that ended much more pleasantly than I thought. Everyone's up and at him. Hmm. And reeking of booze. That hat was a memento, Lambert. Hmm. Relax, old man. It'll come out in the wash. You can give the boys a rap on the knuckles later. Let's get to work. Vesemir, learn anything? While you were out hunting fork tails and playing with a megascope, I examined Uma. Notice one thing. At moments of, what's the term, uh, relaxed consciousness, he behaves differently. While falling asleep, he'd pause awake for an instant. Something different about his movements, his gaze then, but only for a moment. So I induced a trance, hypnotized him essentially. No effect at first, but as he dropped into deep lethargy, I heard something. A sigh or a moan. It wasn't Uma's voice. All right. I just don't get how that helps us. Then keep silent. Thank you, Vesemir. And I apologize for what I said earlier. Have the boys told you what we plan to do? Yes. Don't like it one bit. But I suppose I have to trust you. Thought we got rid of that table ages ago. <sighs> Must be 50 years since I last saw Sad Albert. Couldn't bear to part with it. Thought we might find a use for it one day. You know how old people are. Oh, sure. yes. Every grandpa out there's got an attic full of torture devices. Right. So what now? We can begin. We need only brew the potions. Wait. Why couldn't we... Do it earlier? Because the preparatory potions for the trial are strongly reactive. They must be administered immediately after they're brewed. Satisfied? Geralt, make the potions. Here are the formulae. Eskel, take a bottle of spirit. Uh, no. After last night, I 
and disinfect the tools. Well, chop chop. Yeah. Okay. You don't know who's trapped in Uma's Let me body. save, damn it. Figure the proportions. Performed a series of complex calculations. Extrapolated some data. Planned simulations. Meaning you guessed. Uh huh. Yep, again with that. Okay. I know so much shit. At the bottom, okay. The coction of the grasses. We got, what do we got here? Albino bruja tongue. Manticore poison gland. Mandrake root. Brionia. Forktail spinal fluid. And rib leaf. It has been the process in which a normal human is mutated into that of a witcher. Save, 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 save. There, okay, we got it. Nailed it. Bring in the potions. There. Potions ready. Tools too. Good. Vesemir. Pokeweed extract to deaden the pain. I know. Done this before. Eskel. Make the incisions in his veins. Insert the tubes. Geralt, place the potion vials in the feeders. Ready. Open the valves. It doesn't matter in which order. Okay. Doesn't matter the order, so. The hook we'd work? If it hadn't, the pain would have sent him into shock, killed him. So, everything's going smoothly? No, but it's within known norms. Administer the next potion. I feel the same. I know, Fracta. Come on, Uma. Come on. I had hoped. I'd hoped I would never have to watch this again. Why'd you keep the table then? Geralt, next potion. Echo on a golf club with the eye of Sauron. Now Sauron. to do their work might take a day might take more you need only wait true but i must maintain the stabilizing spell uma's body is not nearly as resilient as a young candidate witches without this he do that Eskel, i'm sorry would you mind getting some rags on it I 
can't believe we're doing this. Wiping vomit off the floor? No. The trial. If that's Siri in there, she could come out of this crippled, wrong in the head, just emotionless. Thought about that? Of course I have. Thing is, we don't have a choice. Not anymore, we don't. But we rushed it. Should have started by... Gentlemen, the floor's as clean as it'll ever be. And I need to be wiped down as well. No offense, but I'd rather Geralt did it. Understood. I'd prefer that too.